Silva Vervoort here with Technical Analysis Part 8. We will now discuss a few of the more important price top and bottom reversal patterns. If you like this video, pay a visit to my website at stoccata.org. The final purpose of this video series is to teach you how to trade successfully applying technical analysis techniques. Chart patterns can be part of buying and selling rules in technical analysis trading. Chart patterns give an important confirmation for the next trend move. The art is to distinguish that you are dealing with a continuation pattern after which the price will continue its previous trend or a reversal pattern leading to a trend reversal. Look in this chart at the complex head and shoulders top reversal pattern and the diamond bottom reversal. We will talk about continuation patterns like the rectangle continuation pattern in this chart in our next video. The head and shoulders formation belongs with an accuracy of about 90% to the most reliable reversal patterns. The price moves in an uptrend. Only after the pattern has formed you will recognize A as the left shoulder. The price drops back to the support B of the upgoing trend line. From here the price makes a last move up to C, often with lower volume compared to the A move. This will be the head of the pattern. The turning point at B will be part of the neckline. Next the price drops through the upgoing trend line and falls back to the level of the neckline D. After that the price will move up again to E to form the right shoulder. From here the price will drop below the neckline making lower lows. The shoulders AE and the neckline BD in the head and shoulders formation should be about the same price level and about the same distance in time from the head. The head and shoulders pattern is confirmed when the price falls below an uptrending neckline or after the right shoulder in case of a downtrending neckline. In approximately half of the cases there is a bounce back to the neckline G or even up to between the neckline and the right shoulder. This chart shows you a real head and shoulders top reversal formation. With the head and shoulders formation you can basically also calculate a price target. You measure the distance from the top of the head till the lowest point of the neckline and project this distance downwards. This will give you a theoretical price target. Here the pattern is confirmed when the price falls below the uptrending neckline. Uh, mirroring the head and shoulders top reversal pattern gives a head and shoulders bottom reversal pattern. Shoulder bottoms should be at around the same price level and at about the same distance from the head. The head and shoulders bottom reversal pattern here with an ascending neckline is confirmed when price turns up after the right shoulder. A complex head and shoulders top reversal pattern will have more shoulders or more heads, but rarely both. The shoulder tops are around the same price level and at approximately the same distance from the head. The complex head and shoulders pattern is confirmed when the price falls below an uptrending neckline or as in this chart after the internal right shoulder in case of a downtrending neckline. Mirroring the complex head and shoulders top reversal pattern gives you a head and shoulders bottom reversal pattern. Triple tops and bottoms are a variation of the head and shoulders theme. The difference is that tops or bottoms are at approximately the same level. Triple tops and bottoms offer a reliable pattern 
with an accuracy of about 80%. A triple top is confirmed when the price falls below the lowest valley as shown in this chart. A triple bottom formation is confirmed when the price rises above the highest top of the pattern, as in this example chart. A double top reversal pattern is formed with a large demand during the formation of the first top and a lack of demand with the second top. With daily price bars, tops are separated by about 2 up to 8 weeks and should only have a small difference in price level. The in-between reaction should have a price drop of about 10% on average. With an accuracy of 80% this pattern is very reliable. The pattern is confirmed when the price falls below the level of the middle reaction. For a double bottom the reasoning is analog to that of a double top. The trend is down and a double bottom pattern is formed as an indication that the trend will probably reverse. With daily price bars, bottoms are separated by about 2 up to 8 weeks and should only have a small difference in price level. The in-between reaction should have an average price rise of about 10%. With 80% reversals, this pattern is very reliable. The pattern is confirmed when the price rises above the level of the middle reaction. A rounding bottom pattern appears on daily and weekly bar charts. This pattern takes time to complete. The price can peak halfway through the pattern, but usually it retraces most of it quickly. Rounding bottoms are becoming rare because of today's high volatility of the markets as a result of the information society. Rounding bottoms lead to a price reversal 90% of the time. The pattern confirms when the price closes above the highest peak of the pattern. There may be a saucer lip when the price drops temporarily before continuing the uptrend. A V formation bottom reversal creates a V character. A top reversal creates an inverted V character. The price at the start of the V formation will form a one day reversal, an island reversal or a spark. A V formation start can be recognized most of the time when it breaks the last possible steep trend line together with a candlestick reversal pattern and a one day island or a spark reversal. A one day top reversal shown in this chart arises if the price makes on the same day a new high, reverses and closes below the closing price of the previous day. A one day top reversal in a candle chart is a black candle and often part of a candlestick pattern. An island reversal occurs when a number of price bars are isolated by a window at the beginning and end of the island pattern. This island is confirmed if the second window is formed. The windows should be more or less at the same price level. The bottom V formation spark reversal pattern shown in this chart arises if the price makes on the same day a very big positive move compared to the previous bars. In a candlestick chart this will be a big white candle at the bottom or a big black candle at the top. The big candle itself is the buying signal at the bottom and the selling confirmation at the top. I have shown you those that I consider the most important price reversal patterns used in technical analysis. The following video we will have a look at price continuation patterns and patterns that either can be a reversal or a continuation pattern. These patterns will certainly help you with your trading based on technical analysis. Watch out for this next video. Stay in touch. 
subscribe to my channel, tell your friends and pay a visit to my website stoccata.org. Have a nice day and I see you soon again.